Just as emotional outside as it was uh, inside the Cross Insurance Center today, the sheer uh, sight of just so many people, so many officers who uh, made the visit here from all corners of the United States today to pay their respects to Jean Cole. Now, uh, law enforcement tradition, that was the first thing that happened, a flag folding ceremony where the pallbearers uh, fold the American flag that was draped over Corporal Cole's casket and then presented to the family, handed to Cole's wife, Cheryl, Mary for 41 years. The pain there is palpable. Another dramatic moment, a flyover, all eyes to the sky. Four aircraft from the state police, the main Marine Patrol, the Warden Service, and the Forest Service flew in formation over that crowd of some 3,500 people who gathered outside to watch. I spoke with a police officer who said they came all the way from Texas to pay their respects. It's not just felt in Maine. It's felt all over the country. We felt it in Dallas. Um, we brought New York, Chicago, Aurora, Colorado with us uh, just to come out and show some support and uh, let them know they're not alone. Certainly not alone today, that is for sure, and a fitting tribute to this man that was so well known, so well respected. And I have to say, I was struck by what uh, Sheriff Lancaster said during his uh, speech there inside about his deputy, and he said this, goodbye for now, my friend, you will never we will never forget you. And it really was uh, quite fitting and quite uh, somber and just really all around uh, sad and appropriate. So we're live in Bangor right now. Jim Keithley, WMTW News 8.